What's up guys, it's Ryan here bringing you some Classic Royale gameplay and today we'll be using basically the same deck I've always been using um, but I am at, I think, I'm only three trophies away from my highest my highest uh, trophies. Let's go ahead and see if we can uh, beat, the, beat, the, beat the record. Alright, so we got 58 gold, one tombstone, and eight royal giants. Uh, so that's not really good since I don't use Royal Giants. 70 gold, 2 gems, 4 archers, and uh, 5 Teslas. 71 gold, 2 gems, 1 rocket, and 8 Teslas. So that was kind of pointless. Um, but let's go ahead and look in the shop actually. See if we can actually... Hold on. Okay, so I can, I'm actually going to buy some of these because I need some of these. Um, some Spear Goblins uh, right there. Okay. So we got that taken care of. We are using this deck once again, and uh, let's go ahead and straight into it, and uh, yeah. So we got our first match. It is a level 9. We are in the ice arena, which I don't know how he's in the ice arena, because he's at 2274. That's strange. Okay. But... Um, I dropped my giant on the or my damn yeah, my giant on the right side. He dropped his pack on the left side. Uh, this could go bad pretty easily, but I'm gonna wait until I can take out that wizard because pack I can usually like distract, but the wizard I cannot. I'm gonna take out that wizard. There we go. The wizard is gonna be taken down, and we're just gonna zap this. So we got a few hit points done on the uh, right tower, but we got tons of giant or. Er, barbarians that are coming down and I'm actually gonna put a wizard they're gonna do decent damage maybe a lot of damage um, but okay maybe a lot of damage <laughs> but uh, not too much to worry about at the moment so the princess is gonna go down because of the wizard the wizard takes it out takes her out and I got a few hit points off that tower so I'm gonna use my wit or my archers and my Valkyrie because um, why not? And the wall breaker is, or the bomber is going to be taken out very easily because the Valkyrie and the archers followed, followed the, followed behind. All right, so right now uh, he definitely does have the uh, the advantage right now. He's got uh, about 900 less hit points on my tower. So he done he has done more damage onto my tower. I'm going to basically drop a bomb tower, but he's actually gonna be able to get my troops or my building right there, and that's not gonna help me whatsoever. But I'm gonna get rid of the of the uh, the art the art the queen, and um, yeah. All right, so I'm just going to put another elixir collector. We're at one minute or 45 seconds left, and now I want to be able to make a big push. So I'm going to put my giant on the left side. I'm going to put uh, mini Pekka, Walbreaker, Valkyrie in the front, and uh, zap all these and put the wizards down. The wizard is going to take down, take care of all the uh, troops that are in the air right there. I'm going to put another giant down, although this kind of didn't work very well so I don't think I'm gonna be able to get the win kind of had a really bad start that rage spell and barbarians definitely did tons of damage on my power my tower and it just did not work out very well I hate princesses um I called her a queen earlier it's princess it's princess okay so we did not win we got one star or one crown against them so um let's go ahead and battle again Alright, so we are facing a level 9 in the Arena 7, I think. Just going to put the Bomb Tower. Going to put the Mini P.E.K.K.A. because the Mini P.E.K.K.A. does great against Royal Giants. And I definitely want to get rid of him because he shoots, or he has range. And he does pretty good, decent damage against uh, towers and everything. So I definitely want to get rid of him as soon as possible, which I did. So it's not a big worry, but uh, later in the raid, it might be a big problem. All right, so I was the first one to hit his tower, or hit a tower. And 
I'm going to put a Valkyrie on the left side just because I can. And then he's going to put a cannon down, so I probably I made a smart move and put the Elixir Collector down because he's not going to come any troops, not going to come with any troops towards me. I'm going to drop a Zap spell on those uh, Spear Goblins, and that's going to take them out. So his cannon is out. I'm going to put a Bomb Tower and then my Mini P.E.K.K.A. down. And hopefully, yep, the um, archers were being attacked. So, so there we go. We got rid of all the royal giant, the fire spirits, and the archers. So we're doing pretty well. I mean, we're not doing good, but um, definitely doing better than he is. I'm going to put an elixir, an elixir collector down and uh, pretty much going to wait and see what he does. Gonna put a wizard, a wizard down, and then I'm gonna zap these right there. Gonna put archers down. Hopefully this will do some decent damage. So the wizard is gonna go down. Sadly, the wizards go down goes goes down because I really needed him. Um, but the, I got a few, I got a few archers that will uh, actually do some pretty good damage toward the tower. The Valkyrie almost went for the tower. But uh, the spear goblins kind of got in the way and pretty much took the spotlight. All right, so now we're going to we're going to drop the I put the um I'm gonna put a Valkyrie down. I put the mini Pekka on the right or left side, which was not a good idea. I didn't know he was gonna drop his uh, royal giant, but not gonna be a problem because he does not do any damage to my right tower. He's going to use a fireball on my right side, which takes out all my wizards, all my archers, and everything in between. And uh, now we just got the giants going in, and we're going to be able to get this tower. So that means we're going to be going to be winning this battle. And it looks like a pretty well-deserved battle because I played it better. He had a cannon, which didn't really do damage or do much to me. So all the uh, trophies... That we lost in the last battle um i gained back so let's go ahead and do another battle and see what this battle can do and see if we can beat our record all right so we are facing a level nine right here i'm gonna go ahead and maybe put down a elixir collector mm, elixir collector down he hasn't placed anything yet there we go he has elixir collector too so we're evenly tied at the moment. I'm going to put archers down. Going to wait for that. He is going to use a fireball, which is going to take out most of my elixir collector. So kind of upset about that. But let's keep moving on. All right, so that wizard, or that uh, Valkyrie, didn't do very much damage to the bomb tower. I mean, it took out half of the tower. But it's not that big of a deal. Gonna zap. Gonna zap the barbarians just because I thought I needed to. And the wizard is gonna do tons of damage. And uh, looks like both wizards are going to die actually. Mini P.E.K.K.A. And then the archers to take care of this hog rider. So he doesn't do too much damage on our tower. Which he did not do too much damage at all. So the mini pack is going to take care of this, these, uh, the cannon. I'm going to put a bomb tower. Take care of these barbarians before they even get a touch on the bomb tower. They didn't even get a touch. Um, so now basically I'm going to, might as well drop an elixir collector. Although he's probably going to use a fireball, so that's probably not a good idea. But, um... Right now, it's evenly matched for the most part. It's got a few more hit points done on my tower. But I'm not too concerned about that because I know I could possibly come back. Because now, we got the, now we're at the one minute mark. He's actually going to use a fireball right on my wizard. And that could be a game changer. So that didn't work out too well. Um... Wizard gets zapped. Okay, the wizard just gets taken out, so that's a good thing. Um, 
I need to get a giant and wizard combo just because it's a really good combo that I enjoy using. So the wizard, he's probably going to use a fireball again. He's got a wizard and uh, I'm going to put mini Faka. So everything's clumped up together, but I'm going to use a zap spell and this will help most of the troops uh, make a way through. So the giant gets to the tower. Mini Pekka is going to do tons of damage towards that tower. Uh, and I got the win. So we got a comeback. I didn't even see that happen. The wizard and the, um, the Mini Pekka did tons of damage all in one and one or two seconds. And uh, it was a great com comeback. And I got a gold chest for that and 29 trophies. So we are actually now at my new record, 23.04. And I'm in Frozen Peak. First time in Frozen Peak ever. So I'm pretty excited about that. Uh, we got the bowlers we can unlock. We got the lumberjack we can unlock. And we got the ice spirits, which we can now unlock. And um, now I can donate more. How much can I donate? I can, uh, I can donate probably the same. I don't know. It's... Um, I can actually donate tons more. No, maybe not. Nope, it's the same. It's the same for donating. Same for donating and uh, pretty excited about that. So we got our legendary arena. Or not legendary, our frozen peak arena. And I'm pretty excited about that. But yeah, guys, that's going to go ahead and end the video. I'm pretty excited that I beat my record. And I just got to arena 8 for the first time. But if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you give a thumbs up and subscribe for more. And until next time, peace out.